It's a very windy day here in the south of England. The sun is shining bright and I cannot remember the last time it rained and that is actually saying something considering considering England. But it's very windy so it's very difficult to vlog. It's likely to be my last vlog until I go to Morocco. I'm going to Morocco in about in about five days and I shall be there in about three weeks. I just really thought I'd go for a nice little walk. I do like doing Englishy style vlogs. It's nice. I didn't mind the Italian ones. I love the Ghanaian ones and I'm pretty sure I'm going to love the Moroccan ones. So I'm going to be there for about three weeks three weeks so I'm of course gonna grab all kinds of footage for you to watch I find myself really itching to just get back out somewhere, somewhere new. I can't stay home for too long, otherwise I just start to feel trapped. No, I don't like it. So I can't really speak too much in this vlog either, because it's too windy and it's gonna just blow all over the microphone. Oh look, looks like I'm gonna have to climb over this thing. <laughs> Do this one handed is so much fun. Ah, lovely. Sun is going down, I've still got quite a lot of daylight left, but head towards home now. I'm about to do my hair up. <laughs> the wind. Earlier on this afternoon, I found myself conversing with a man just outside a local coffee shop in this town, and we were conversing about what I'm what I'm going to do in the future, career-wise. And I've got it narrowed down to two things at the time being. It's either like an English teacher in a foreign country, or something in agriculture, gardening, that sort of thing. So I do gardening now. When I was 19, my mind completely changed. I was into IT and computers and all that sort of stuff. And as soon as I finished college, shortly after, I completely lost the interest. Completely. Still the exact same today. I'm not really. I'm not really into that. I'm into computers, like edit, editing and whatnot. But I don't know. I guess I'm just not really wanting that as a career. So I don't know. That's still my. Still one of my life missions, I guess. Which is, what do I want to do in this life, like career-wise, as a job, something to in the future support my family and myself. And question number two is, why am I here? Why am I here? Oh, and another one is. Who am I? That's something I'm also seeking as well. But the three things I'm seeking in this life, what I want to do, why am I here, and who am I? It seems lately everything I do in life at the moment, more recently to be fair, I may act a certain way or I may think a certain way, and then it always comes down to the end. But who am I? But who am I? I make videos for YouTube, I write vlogs for YouTube. But who am I? They are the three things I'm trying to figure out. Maybe travelling is how I'm figuring these things out. Or maybe it's how I will figure these out. What I would like to do in the future to figure out why I am here. Why I exist. And then who am I? Sometimes I think I know who I am, but a year ago I was a bit of a different person. Then the year before that I was a bit of a different person. So every year I'm changing. But who am I? Who am I? The name Jason doesn't really mean anything to me, but I suppose it's like the name of my identity, I suppose. But then again, what's my identity? Who am I? So maybe that's why I'm travelling. I'm supposed to be on this path to figure out who I am. Because I have always wandered off in a different path to all my friends and to everyone maybe at school. Because of maybe the difficulties I had as a child or my Asperger's. I don't know. So I'm trying to figure out now, I suppose. So this lad in college, I didn't know him. He was with a group of friends who was friends with one of my friends in college. I can't remember that part of the detail. All of a sudden, he randomly asked me, how would you define success? And that's a question I've never actually forgotten. I didn't actually have an answer to give. I was only 19, or maybe 18 at the time. I didn't really have an answer to give him. But, but ever since he's asked me that question, I've actually never forgotten his face, and I've never actually forgotten that question. And to this day, I'm, I'm sort of still pondering as, as to what is the actual definition of success. Does one define success? Can one person define his or her own success? I don't know. Do I define my own success? Is success just with money and how big is your house and how fancy your car is? Is success how happy you are in life? I don't know, I'm still pondering that question now, but right now what I'm thinking is success would be, would be for me to figure out those three questions, those three personal questions I have in life. What do I want to do? What would I like to do in life? Why am I here? And then number three, but who am I? Who am I? If I can confidently answer those three questions one day, I think that would be a definition of personal success. To me anyway. 
to me. So then, I have a question for you. What do you define as success? And do you have any personal questions that you need to answer, that you wish you had the answers for? Any personal questions for yourself? I know I do. Thank you for watching this video. Please give it a comment, let me know what you think. Give it a like as well, that'd be great. And if you're new to this channel, do subscribe. I like to wander around. It's almost like it's the name of my YouTube channel. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you all soon.